Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Michelle, a registered nurse in Canada. So I know it's been a really long time since I last posted a video, but I am back here today and I'm going to be sharing with you 25 vocabulary related to female reproductive health. Now, without further ado, let's get started. So the first term is menstrual cycle, menstrual cycle, menstrual cycle, or you can just say period, period, period. Now, an example is, I'm on my period. I'm on my period. I'm on my period. So it's kind of like a tongue twister. You know, you just say, I'm on my period. And then you, when you say it faster, um, it kind of jumbles together. Anyways, the second term is regular. 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 So, for example, my cycles are regular. My cycles are regular. My cycles are regular. Or you can say, my periods are regular. My periods are regular. My periods are regular. Number three, irregular. Irregular or irregular. So it doesn't really matter what tone you use to say it. People can understand either way. So you can just say irregular. So for example, my cycles are irregular. My cycles are irregular. My cycles are irregular. Or, my periods are irregular. My periods are irregular. My periods are irregular. Light flow. Light flow. Light flow. So an example is, uh, my flow is usually light. My flow is usually light. My flow is usually light. Or, my periods are light. My periods are light. My periods are light. Next is heavy flow. Heavy flow. Heavy flow. So for example, my flow is usually heavy. My flow is usually heavy. My flow is usually heavy. Or you can say, my periods are usually heavy. My periods are usually heavy. My periods are usually heavy. Menopause, menopause, menopause. So for example, I'm in menopause. I'm in menopause. I'm in menopause. Spotting, spotting, spotting. So for example, I've been experiencing some spotting outside of my regular periods. Odor, odor, odor. Or you can say smell smell, smell. So for example, you can say, I've noticed this fishy odor coming from my vagina, or you can say, I've noticed this fishy smell coming from my vagina. Vaginal discharge, vaginal discharge, vaginal discharge. Or you can just say, discharge, 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 to shorten it. So for example, I've noticed increased vaginal discharge. I've noticed increased discharge. Menstrual cramps. Menstrual cramps. Menstrual cramps. Or period cramps. Period cramps. Period cramps. So for example, I have very painful menstrual cramps. Or I have very painful period cramps. Tampons. 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 For example, I use tampons when I'm on my period. Sanitary pads, sanitary pads, sanitary pads. But we usually just shorten it and we say pads, pads, pads. So for example, I use pads when I'm on my period. So I use pads when I'm on my period. I use pads when I'm on my period. Fertility, fertility, fertility. So for example, I'm looking for more information on fertility treatments. Contraceptives, contraceptives, contraceptives. So for example, what contraceptives do you recommend for me? Birth control pills, birth control pills, birth control pills. For example, I'm currently taking birth control pills. Intrauterine device, intrauterine device, intrauterine device. 
Now, usually we abbreviate it to just say IUD. So IUD, IUD. For example, you can say, I would like to have an IUD inserted. Pap smear, pap smear, pap smear. Or you can say, pap test, pap test, pap test. For example, do you recommend I get a pap smear to screen for cervical cancer? Pelvic exam, pelvic exam, pelvic exam. So for example, when should I get a pelvic exam? Vagina, vagina, vagina. Cervix, cervix, cervix. Uterus, uterus, uterus. Fallopian tubes, fallopian tubes, fallopian tubes. Ovaries, ovaries, ovaries. Eggs, eggs, eggs. Or um, if you want to say the more medical term, it would be ova, ova, ova. And then an example of a healthcare professional who specializes in the health of the female reproductive system is a gynecologist, gynecologist, gynecologist. All right, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video is helpful to you. And I will see you soon. Thanks again, guys. Bye.